Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Janet and I am a stay-at-home mom to two little boys. I have a three-year-old and a four-month-old. Today I will be sharing with you the diaper bag that transitioned with me from one child to two kids. I don't like to think of myself as the overpacker. I'm thinking myself as the prepared one. So I've been using this diaper bag for about six six months and I did get it on Amazon. I didn't get it from their website but this is the Miss Fong diaper backpack and it is a total dupe for the Fong design. I thought it was really cute and practical and perfect but I didn't want to pay that price so I got this one, Miss Fong. I'm gonna go ahead and share with you everything that's in there and how I use the pockets and how I pack it and all of that. So let's get into it. So this is what the diaper bag looks like. It is a backpack style bag. And when you order it, it comes with the two stroller straps. These are the stroller straps. And it also comes with the messenger bag, the same color. Um, but it's this material rather than this like seatbelt material. I don't know what it's called, but yeah. So I broke off this little tag thing that I had to open and close the zipper. And I just added a key ring. I used to have a pom-pom on it, but kids, you know. So anyway, this. It comes with the golden hardware and it has one pocket one pocket without a zipper and one zippered pocket on each side and also in the front so it comes with one open pocket and one zippered pocket and then it has just this one large pocket that opens up all the way so you have easy access to all of your stuff and in the back it has this little opening for your wipes and i will go ahead and share a little bit of my thoughts on everything like i said before i've been using this diaper bag for maybe five six months now it, i started off with only one child and now i have two boys and this just fits everything that i need for a full day out with both my kids. So I'm gonna go ahead and start off with the outside, show you what's in um, what's in each pocket. So starting off over here in this open pocket, I have this little burp cloth, which is something that I need all the time with a four month old. Uh, so I keep this handy, you know, I just need to pull it out and wipe the spit up because Diego is the king of spit ups. So yeah, I use that for that. Um, usually I'll have like a burp cloth or like one of those bibs in here. And the zippered one, I only have a pen. Uh, I don't use this much because sometimes when I have the water bottles inside or my bottle inside, um, this bag isn't as stretchy. So if I'm using the inside pocket, uh, I don't really get to use this. It only fits this. In so I don't have the ability to fit my whole hand in here if I were to have a whole water bottle inside um, the diaper bag. So, yeah. And yeah. Uh, on, these, on this other side pocket, I have Diego's sunglasses. And David's are usually in here too, but he's wearing them right now out in the living room so just like the other side this side if i were to have a bottle inside the diaper bag i wouldn't be able to use this pocket as much so i don't have things that will sink all the way in uh, because i won't be able to reach them so that's that and in this zippered pocket i don't have anything so i love these zippers because they're so easy to open and close like i don't have much of a problem with the zipper. They're so smooth. So in this uh, large pocket, this is usually where I, I keep my phone. Um, it goes all the way to the bottom, so it's not like sticking out. And I have the iPhone 7. And here I just have my, my little case for my glasses. And in this one, I have an extra charger connection, a chapstick. Uh, 
Another little thing to clean my glasses. The adapter for my iPhone. And that's it. And I'm just going to put everything back in here because I don't want to end up with a mess. So on to the inside of the diaper bag. It's like a half circle and it opens all the way and I just fold the flap back and it opens the whole way. Now what I like about this diaper bag is that it's tall. So instead of like packing stuff and like adding, um, like ending up with this like big hunchback on your back, um, it's just a little... It's a little thinner. You just stack stuff up rather. Um, usually up in the top, I'll toss in the sweaters. It's been really hot here in California this week, but then at night it gets a little chilly. So just in case, I like to throw those in there. Um, I like to stack them last because usually I'll take them out and leave them in the car. If we're going into a restaurant, if we're going to grandma's house, I'll leave them in the car and if it gets chilly, then I'll go ahead and grab them. This is what it looks like before I dive in. Now this bag has a lot of pockets around the lining, so I don't have to depend a lot on like um, little bags, but I do like to have some of them uh, just to organize it a little better, but you don't have to depend on those with this diaper bag because like I said, it has a lot of pockets around it and we'll get to that. So it has this little key Bob thing but I use it for this little bag for the dirty diapers these are by the Arm & Hammer brand and they are scented to avoid any extra smelly diapers I have these uh, markers that I got from the 99 cent store and it's just to keep my older um, kid entertained and I am using formula for my four month old. I do nurse maybe three times a day, but my breast is more of a snack at that. And then I have this little book for restaurants just in case we're going out with friends and we're not really like 100% being attentive with, our, with my oldest. Um, I can just pull this out. And he loves this one because it has a little bit of everything. It has pirates, dinosaurs, farm animals. It has puzzles. It has matching games, uh, tracing games, uh, some where he can just color and draw. Um, and it has a little bit of the, a little bit for the older kids. It has some addition, some subtraction. So I really like this one. This one is from Target Dollar Spot, and it was three dollars. And I love this. I, we sometimes do it at home as well. Then I have this little bag also from Target Dollar Spot, and I use it as a wet bag. So it was just a dollar. And the diaper bag also comes with this changing pad. It's like that wipeable uh, material here and the same material as the diaper bag out here. Then in this little baggie, this is like my bag. This is my little mommy bag. And I have a little bit of everything as you can see. I have a nursing pad, I have more pens, uh, nipple cream, I have lotion, my headphones, I have an extra sanitizer, and this little cool fan, you connect your phone to it. You connect your phone to it and it's just, it's an extra little fan. I have a roller ball, some Moltren, and a mirror. So. All of that is in here and that, like I said, is my bag. Then I have one more little bag with all the extra stuff that I don't use on every diaper change um, and some medicine. I have antibiotic ointment, I have antibiotic wipes, I have some baby lotion. This is the Aveeno. I just put it in a little tube that I got from Daiso and it came two in a pack. And I have some Tylenol, some Desitin for diaper rash, and a little nail clipper. 
I have some band-aids because boys. And there's that. That's what's in there. And then I have this one that is empty right now, but this is usually where I keep my little snacks. Usually yogurt covered raisins and granola bars. And then for clothes, I carry still um, a change of clothes for my older one, some undies, a pair of shorts, and an extra t-shirt. And then for my little one, I have a long sleeve onesie. I have just a regular onesie and some pants just in case it gets a little cold. And that's everything that was in the middle. Now onto the side pockets. So it has one, two, three, four, five, six pockets. Um, six pockets around and then also this large zippered pocket here. So let's get in there. Right now I only have one diaper, but for my little one, these are a size, these are a size three, um, but I usually carry about four small diapers for my baby and then one diaper for my older kid. Um, if we're coming home back from grandma's house late at night, I don't like to embarrass him if he pees on himself. So just spare him the embarrassment and Put him in a diaper when i know he's gonna fall asleep and he's probably gonna pee in his car seat so like i said just spare him the embarrassment and i don't have to wash the car seat so i do put him in a diaper bag uh, in a diaper if i know we're coming home late and he's probably going to fall asleep so that's that and in this one i have all of my wipes i have my boogie wipes i love these I have these new Kleenex wet wipes. I've been trying them out and they do work. They are just so thick and yes, they work, but I don't know. I just feel like they're like too thick. Is that such a thing? But yeah, that. And then I have this pack of Pampers. Usually I do carry the Kirkland brand. And so this wipey bag has this little bag here and I'll show you how that works. This is usually the brand that I use and right now it's it has only a few uh, wipes left. So for this opening to be aligned with this here, you do have to fold this little pack. So I make sure that all the wipes are onto the end and then you're able to fold it and that the opening is like this so I can fit it facing out and like this and this one is actually zippered as well but I never zip it up because I carry a bunch of wipes in there so you can zip it as well then out here now when the diaper bag is completely full it is a little hard to access this so I don't really use it because you have to open it you have to open it and like dig in there and sometimes if you do have your backpack full it's a little hard to pull them out but this but that's how this works um i don't really use it just because sometimes it is i feel like i do struggle with it a little bit um i think it'd be a lot easier if it were like a zipper or a velcro type of bag that would open up just a little bit more just so i have a little more access to this because here i have to completely um take it out and it's not a big problem i just it's not my favorite that's what's in there and then the diaper bag has a two insulated pockets it has one in one on this side and one on this side usually that's where i carry a bottle for feeding and a water bottle so like i was saying if i have these pockets um if i'm using these pockets here the outside pockets are not going to work for extra water bottles just so you know so that's that and then in this little one i just have his binky and a little banana i do use this a little bit just for soothing the gums but it has to be under my supervision because 
I can't give it to him in the car or anything because he'll, he'll just shove this in there and just gag. So I do have to play around with it with him and then just a the regular thingy. And in this other one, I have a selfie stick because why not? And this little towel that it's like a sponge when you wet it. That's when it opens up easier so just in case of an emergency I have to wipe something that I bring that out and then in this zippered bag I just my cash and a wallet which is not in here right now because it's in my car so that's everything that's in my diaper bag and uh, that is it thank you so much for watching I will see you guys on the next one